and watch for Quayfar from the second row as well. Here we go then. They're under starters' orders. We wait for, the, wait for the red light to come on. I'll get my lips in order. Red light's on there. Green, oh. and straight away, and look at that. Akira Yanagawa gets a flyer. Von Tempe got off the line as well, but as predicted, it is Akira Yanagawa straight off there. Fogarty was slack. Kaczynski gets pushed out. Fogarty goes third. Foggy goes third. Keeley is in second place. That horrible first turn has not claimed anybody in shot. And we have a fire down on the oh. line. There was a fire on the line. So, Akira Yanagawa goes first. Is that Keeley coming yes. through? Yes, it is. Keeley looking for a way past Yanagawa. Fogarty's in third place. Hodgson is in fourth place on bike number nine. And then it's Krafar, followed by Kaczynski. So Kaczynski has gone backwards. Yeah, he got off the line well, and he was mugged, not just by Carl on the inside, but Hodgson dropped it across the outside, and followed by Krafar. Here's the flames, number 36, Christian Haus. Well, that Ducati has been on fire, but on fire at the front, Akira Yanagawa. Obvious link usually a, comes from me. <laughs> He's a star, isn't he, this well, boy, Keith? Kawasaki a Jew. Hello. <laughs> What's that, but <laughs> Wrong way. James on. Hayden's team, by the look of it. <laughs> so, there is James yep. Hayden going through on bike number 14. Now, it's about time Kawasaki had a win in this series. They're due. Craig Farr could be the man. He has consistently been quick, but it's Akira Yanagawa who's always qualified well. By my sums, it will be Simon Craig Farr's 100th World Superbike race in the second leg here. I'd never doubt your sums. Ah, oh, with the two Hondas. It's Three it. and two. That is Kaczynski and Aaron Slight almost on top of each other. Apparently, in the press conference, Keith, yesterday, uh, Neil Tuck's the team manager said there will be team orders at the end of the season, and Aaron Slight said in public, I won't obey them. Oh, there you go. Well, he's had team orders before. Remember the Scott Russell days of Kawasaki, yep. but it's Akira Yanagawa who look leads. At, look at Slight in the background, Keith. Yeah, not messing around. Underneath Kaczynski. But it's Yanagawa, Keeley, Fogarty, Hodgson and Krafar. There's Krafar on bike six. Then it's Slight now in front of number three, John Kaczynski. Still Kaczynski on the back of this bunch. Carl Fogarty seemingly no answer to the two men in front of him. Keeley on the fastest lap now. 131.478. Well, that's a little way off of the pole time of 130.8. It's cause for Akira to start worrying, though, I would think. I think when you've got Pierre Francesco behind <laughs> yes. you, you do anyway. Yes. He's such a nice bloke until you look over your shoulder Mind and you, see both, him. Yeah, both these men have actually got tendencies to end up in, uh, how should we say, the gravel trap. Yes, he's just checking Yanagawa's record. There are a couple of get-offs, aren't there? Yeah. And uh, including when Slight rammed him in, in Italy, of course, which wasn't his fault. All's fair in love and war. And that was unfair, Aaron. <laughs> but uh, Aaron was, of course, gracious enough to apologise for that one. Yanagawa all over the bike, throwing his weight to the left there out of that first corner. Yeah, he's pretty dramatic, isn't he? Here we Keeley? go, here we go. Keeley taking a look round the outside. This is going to be a good move from Keeley. Oh. Will he hold it up the inside at this right-hander? The answer, yes. yes. Keeley goes through, but look at that, Yanagawa cuts it tight. Straight underneath him, Yanagawa cuts it tight and drives the Kawasaki. A good gear, good drive, straight out on the short straight. So, Yanagawa... And a brave rider. Well, we know that. <laughs> yes. Yanagawa. <laughs> Such a nice, quiet chap, just like Simon Grover. Could you put him on a racing motorbike? Yanagawa, Keeley, Fogarty. Fogarty just takes a look at his pit board. And Foggy looks to the inside of Keeley. Does he slide through? Yes! Fogarty goes through. Slight's on the fastest bike through the speed trap that time round. No surprise there. Fogarty, though, well, the trouble is it's a bit... Oh, we go. Keeley looks, and this is where he did it on Yanagawa. <laughs> round the outside, it'll be on the inside for the right-hander, but not this time, chap. No, Foggy yeah. had that one covered. Oh, Fogarty, then. What I was about to say is those speed trap figures can be very misleading because you're in the slingshot of somebody in front of you. It will give you maybe four mile an hour more as uh, Carl Fogarty tears off hello, a fighter. Look yeah. at that, Keith. Kaczynski, the fastest lap. This is what we've come to expect from little John. He will start... Oh, look, Yana Gower sideways there. Dear me. Um, that's a frightening corner, that. that it really is a frightening is. corner. Through that long, long right-hander. Yana Gower's next up. But look at Foggy. Foggy comes to the inside. Oh, Ooh. dearie me. That looked like he was on for that one. Akira didn't think so. Backmarkers, this is going to be critical. Backmarkers when you've got four top men all arriving at one corner at the same time. Oh. And you've got a backmarker in the way. It could be a problem. Through goes Carl Fogarty. That is superb. Now, if he can put that backmarker between him and the boys behind. Yes, he's gone through. Now the backmarker's going back behind them all. So yep. it is Fogarty that leads. Akira Yanagawa. No answer straight back from him. But look at the speed of the Kawasaki. Up the inside into this right hander. I don't think so, because that's where Keeley tried it last time. And Foggy was good. And Keeley, so Kaczynski is right there. Kaczynski is on the side. 
tail of Simon Crafar. We expected this. As soon as Foggy made a move, John Kaczynski made a move. Well, in fact, I suppose John made his move first, that quickest lap key. <laughs> so the top two men get it right. Julian, the top two men on the move and a right dogfight in between them. Once he breaks the toe, it's very difficult to break the toe here at the Osprey Obviously Ring, I've been so. told. And that's one of those situations where if Carl can just break that toe, they won't catch him. Remember fast tracks like Monza, like Hockenheim. Yeah, when back, someone gets oh. away, that's the end of it. Now then, that really did put Carl off there. Yeah, Mr. Rexburger. Yes, and of course, Kawasaki got the drive as well. So, oh, Re go. Rex Berger yeah. himself balked Carl. Carl had to knock the throttle. That took the drive away from him down that straight. And of course, Akira Yanagawa, just being a bit further back, was able to keep the power on. And that gave him that slingshot down the straight. So, Carl's got it all to do again now. We should not be running into back markers at a World Championship race less than halfway through the, the, the distance. No, that is it's bad. Very, very annoying indeed. So, then, looking at the. And again, Aaron's like 242 that time through the speed trap. Oh, let's take another look at this. This has got to be Crafar coming in here sideways. Yes, I thought it had to be. <laughs> Who else? Unbelievable. Well, we're sitting on the fence, but uh, one man that we're not going to allow to do that is Terry Reimer back in the studio. Terry, uh, sit up straight there, chap, won't you? What's going on here? <laughs> well, it's uh, certainly um, interesting to see Yanagawa. He's really fast in the second half of the, cir of the circuit, which is going to be really important towards the end of the race. Uh, I think Carl's looking really strong also. I think and what it's going to be now? between them two. Here we go. Look at that, yeah. Terence, just yeah. as you speak. Through it comes up. Looks like Carl. that Ducati's pretty quick. It does, doesn't it? He, has he got to take it all back now, do you think? No, I don't think so. No, I, 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 certainly the fastest bike out there is Aaron. Uh, it's good to see Aaron up there again because he's had a couple of uh, lean races. But, thanks very much, Terry. Well, Carl Fogarty hits the front again. And he's looking as if he's back on for this race win. This was where he was a few laps ago. A back marker thwarted his attempt to get away. Maybe he's now decided that... Uh, Akira Yanagawa has set the pace. He's now the fastest man on the track, but expect Carl Fogarty, when he crosses the line, to be under the pole man's time. Fogarty leads. Akira Yanagawa is second. Oh, we can take another look at this. This is Fogarty's wheelie, but more indicating, more, more interesting, I should say, than, than that, is this particular manoeuvre here from uh, John Kaczynski, one foot off the footrest. Maybe it was uh, beginning to spin at the rear end and uh, he decided to have a quick dab. Dabbing out the section. Foggy still leads. Keeley still... Oh, what am I talking about? Akira still second. Yanagawa. Then it's Keeley. Then it's uh, Aaron Slight. Then it's Simon Crafar. And on the back of the bunch is still number three, John Kaczynski. I reckon, I reckon there's only six men in this race, you know. Yeah. I can't see anybody else except back Yeah, there's a couple of blokes about uh, half an hour further back. I think Scott Russell and Jim Whitton. Yeah, but, uh, that, that's not a bad quality <laughs> field back there. <laughs> That's not bad. He's on world champion, lurking a bit further back. Still Fogarty leading, though, but he's unable to make the break on Akira Yanagawa. This is where Akira took a look. Oh, not surprised either. Yeah, oh, oh, both oh, of them. Oh, dear Close. me. That's why he ran wide. Do you remember when I said he yep. ran wide? Yep. Well, I didn't spot the reason why. It's because he nearly took out Carl Fogarty. Because he was out of control there, basically, well, for the he's, moment. He's on the rear wheel up in the air and uh, wasn't scrubbing off any speed at all. And that really was a major problem there. Oh. Coming to the line again. We're getting towards the closing stages of this race. Yanagawa still wants it for Kawasaki. He pulls out a Fogarty slipstream. This time he may have it on the brakes, but I don't think so. Look at that. Again, Carl so smooth running in there on the brake. Oh, Carl. Well, he's not so smooth getting out of there, though, <laughs> yes. is he? And Yanagawa well, looks that's, smoother. That's because Carl's trying to get the power down so early now to try and keep the momentum in front of that Kawasaki because the Kawasaki looks so good. Up the inside, Carl. Will Akira Yanagawa be able to get under there? No, and that back marker cuts off Akira Yanagawa. Back marker cut off Akira Yanagawa. That could be the break that Carl Fogarty needs. With less than three laps to go, that could be the crucial point in this race. Aaron Slight now is homing in on the pair of them in front, and we have just over a lap to go. Here is Yanagawa. Yanagawa, yes. yes! And that is where he's been looking at it now. For the last four or five laps, he really has got that Kawasaki worked out. From my point of view, that's good. Now it's down to a dogfight. We come to start the last lap. Yanagawa leads. Fogarty second. Slight is third. The battle is on. Fogarty comes to the inside on the brakes. But oh. no, Akira Yanagawa holds it. Slight is there. Slight can still win this. Three-way fight, this. Absolutely a three-way fight. The Killy's out of it in third. Kaczynski's definitely out of it in fifth. Quayfar's tailing off to a lonely Here comes Foggy. Here comes Foggy. Round the outside. He's going to be round this left-hander and then onto the right-hander at the end of it. He's going to be in the break. And here Foggy makes his knees move. Foggy Cole holds it, Lovely. Foggy goes through, nice move, but Yanagawa has that Turns same place to come back.
Watch for Yanagawa up and over the hill. Here's Boggy. Through the left. Now then, here is where Akira Yanagawa builds, builds, builds. He gets quicker and quicker after the chicane here. Watch him go for it now. So the Kawasaki winding up. Kawasaki, but it looks to me like fogarty has got it covered because over the hill. This is where Akira Yanagawa was best before. Fogarty is going to win. Fogarty is going to win. Tactics again. Carl Fogarty. Well, when Akira Yanagawa went, it was too soon. Carl Fogarty knew it. Fogarty comes to the line to take 25 points and regain the series lead. Akira Yanagawa in second place. Aaron Slight in third. And John Kaczynski back in fifth place.